Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu Friends, welcome back to my channel I received a comment from one of my viewers He asked me that uh, how we can check frequency and how we can measure the output voltage of a transformer If we look at this positive terminal this positive terminal is reaching here to the transformer primary This transformer have primary points here 1 and 2 and here we have auxiliary winding, bias winding or VCC winding so it is going to resistor then diode and then capacitor this positive line reaching from here to here and negative line through this resistor current sense resistor that is inside here to the MOSFET source and the drain of the MOSFET is connected to transformer primary winding so we have to check between this point and this point Friends, if you have no good practical experience in power electronics, never try to repair anything. In frequency test mode, connect probes to the transformer primary side. It has 21 kilohertz and it is showing 96% duty cycle. If we reverse the leads, red lead to the positive side of primary winding and black lead to the MOSFET drain side, so we will check the current frequency now now it is green mod frequency because this time it this supply is working without load when it will work with with load white beast frequency will go up to 67 kilohertz if you connect black lead to the positive terminal of the primary winding then the frequency will remain same but the duty cycle will 96 percent because this time our sense line is reversed so we have to connect red lead at positive side how we can check the output voltage of the transformer from these two wires so we cannot check AC voltage at the transformer output because it is high frequency in forward condition its resistance internal resistance is in micro ohm so the voltage drop in the output will in millivolt 1.3 volt AC transformer secondary winding have minimum resistance very low resistance that is in micro ohm so we cannot test voltage in the transformer winding perfectly set multimeter to ac this multimeter is showing 1.1 volt sometimes it is giving zero volt or in millivolt we can check D dc voltage so it will give millivolt 1.1 one, 141 millivolt if we want to test the output of transformer we have to check DC voltage across this diode and it is exact output that is output of the circuit it is 57 volt DC voltage across the diode we have either we have computer power supply we have any type of power supply we we can check the voltage across this diode in forward bias in reverse bias what is the reason transformer primary secondary because this transformer have very low internal resistance it is in micro ohm so from this point to this point there will be no voltage drop if there is a voltage drop that means i into r how much current will flow if transformer have resistance it will cause to drop voltage and it will become heat up maximum voltage will pass through this rectifier and it will reach to the capacitor and in reverse bias in recovery mode we can check voltage here because it is just only the one way the diode is just only a point where we can check the maximum output of the transformer in forward condition it will allow to pass voltage to the capacitor and if we connect multimeter here and here so we will check the voltage across this diode so we have to check the voltage across this diode or this capacitor that is DC voltage if we try to check voltage across this winding we cannot check voltage it is in millivolt sometime in millivolt sometime in microvolt because it is the easiest path for the current all the induced voltage will reach to this rectifier and it will pass to this capacitor so 57 volt output at the capacitor at this capacitor or we can check the same voltage at this diode 
56.88 and the remaining vo voltage in this winding 0.14 volt from here and the other voltage here so total voltage at this capacitor 57.0 volt so friends i hope so this video is informative if it is informative give a thumb up if you have not subscribed my channel subscribe it thanks for watching assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh